Hello everyone, and welcome to Minecraft. Now, a lot has changed since the last episode. If you haven't been watching my streams, you're going to be a little confused. So I'm going to go over it with you. So first off, the mob farm is still existing. But now there's a lot of mobs underneath the uh, temple. We have a storage system. We have a... Owl. We have a map room, which is not done yet. We have a full... Ow. Fully decorated temple, which looks amazing, by the way. We're starting to decorate the outside. We have a little roof, or whatever you want to call it, walkway. The starting island is getting quite full. There's a lot of cows. Um, iron farm is still here. The mob farm hasn't changed its shape or size. I actually don't need any more mob drops for now. I'm actually okay with it. It was starting to lag my world. All the original... Uh, furnaces and stuff are still here. The nether portal hasn't moved. The dock is still the same. Stuff like that. So nothing really changed here. I'm going to show you one of the, not projects, but normal things in the game. And that is my mine. It is absolutely gigantic. And I'm going to go into nether. I'll show you another project that I've been working on on stream. So here, we're going to head in there right now. Ow! That hurt. And that project is this. You know... There's a giant hole up there, and there's all the shulker boxes that I've been using just for this giant cube. Now, it's not a cube, it's a rectangular thingy. This is all hand-carved. Netherrack is pretty easy to mine. All you have to do is just, you know, you can pretty much instant mine it. So... I've just been doing that off of stream because that's pretty, pretty, uh, bad to watch, but you know, I'm calling this the void. I have some big plans with this place, and it's not even done yet, so that's one of the projects. Let's get to it again. We now have a dirt depot, which is the name of it in my way, uh, waypoints list. It's just a giant hole that I'm collecting the dirt out of. Uh, one day, it'll pretty much all be empty. I have an instant mining shovel. So, that's not going to be a problem. I also have a really good bow, <laughs> which can kill creepers and skeletons in one shot. I think zombies too, but that's what my sword does. All I have to do is stand still and just whack. So, next project in 3, 2, 1, yeah! One of my projects is also in the end. I want to flatten the whole area out. I have some really big projects that I want to do here. And uh, my inspiration is from Filza. He's a Twitch streamer. He also has a YouTube channel, and he is insane. You should see his end island, and that's what I kind of want to copy. I'm not copying it, of course, but I will make it my own. But I need to start working on that now, because that project that he did is insane, and he's been working on it for months. So, next project. Woo! Can, can you shut up? Thank you. Jesus. Uh, here is the trading village that I was talking about. There are villagers in every single one of those little pods. That's a, like, the farming area that I have. Why is there a brick over there? Um, for the farming villagers, we've got wheat and potatoes and melons and pumpkins. Now, this little setup here has been making me rich. As you can see, we have one melon and one pumpkin each, eight for each, you know what I mean. So, this is where I'm getting a lot of my resources and building blocks and stuff like that. I can sell my iron from the iron farm to this guy for one apiece right here. And I'll get one emerald for each. So, it's insane. I've also done a couple raids here, but not much. I want to save a lot for camera. But, uh, this is the village that I found. That's, uh, 1,355 blocks away from my base itself. And, uh, I've just been trading, staying here. And, uh, just trading the melons and pumpkins and the, the, the other crops. And just getting a bunch of resources. And I have a lot of emeralds thanks to this village, so... It couldn't be possible without this village. So, I think that's it for the other... Uh, yeah, we've also got a space here for a pyramid project I want to do that's quite a while away. But, uh, it's just another desert that, uh, has nothing in it. And I want to build a giant pyramid here just because why not. I also want to build a desert village here that looks like they're protecting the pyramid, so... There's a lot of projects, but, you know, I don't, I haven't done them yet because I haven't recorded them yet. So, yeah. <laughs> um, anything else? 
I don't think so. No, nothing else. Alright. Well, first things first, I want to go do some... Do I want to do a raid? No, let's go do a raid. Screw it. Let's do it. Yay! The raid is done. Uh, I died a couple times, but that's not too bad. All right, let's get to the projects that actually mean something. Yep. Good little addition to the storage room, I think. What do you guys think? All right, here is everything that we need. We got all of our building prod, like uh, building whatever you want to call these materials. I almost said progress. Building materials there and right there. So let's get to terraforming and let's get to building. I think that's a I think the easiest thing to do is start off with the uh, terraforming and just lay down a bunch of dirt. So I'm going to get to that. No time lapse though because I don't have the option to do that yet. Professional! Alrighty, before we do that, I'm working on a little uh, surprise here. This is going to be gigantic and it's not anywhere done. But if we go look in this chest, you can see... Here we go. We have a little bit of it done already. So, that's nothing. It, this is going to be huge. So, I'm going to go and get it another, like, 20% finished. So, let's hop into it. Okay, so here I went, and I went a map, and, eh, I went and made a map wall. This is something very simple. It's not decorated in the slightest, but it is a 6x6 six six square of everything and we are right now right in the center you can see i'm in my ocean monument if you couldn't tell but uh there you go so we're just surrounded by a bunch of islands and i kind of want to do something stupid i want to make this island triple the size i want to make this one a little bit bigger i want to make this one a little bit bigger this one a little bit bigger these a little bit bigger i i want to make all of these gigantic which means a bunch of terraforming, which also means a bunch of deforestation, because there's a bunch of trees on that island, there's a bunch of trees on that island, there's no trees there, no trees there, there's definitely nothing there, like there's like five grass blocks on that one, you know, there's deforestation there, there, no, I gotta get rid of all of this, but I think it's gonna be worth it, I'm gonna need a lot of sand, and a lot of dirt, and a lot of stone, which is what I, pre I prepared right there, we've got a bunch of stone, Bunch of stone bricks, decorative stone, stuff like that. I just tried to mine that with my uh, rockets there. But we've got a bunch of stone, we've got a bunch of wood for the actual buildings I want to put on there, and a bunch of dirt. And I mean a bunch of dirt. Now that's not even enough for the immense, is that a word? <laughs> immense, gigantic, whatever, project that this is. And I'm going to start laying it out now. When we were on the original map, which is over here in the map room, yet again, nothing is decorated. But over here, you can see that this island has been here every single map, and it's going to. You know, it's going to stay. But what I want to do is I want to make the shape of it better. You know, I've never done anything to that map, but, or to that island, but now I'm going to. Also, if you guys were wondering, there's a 2 to 2 scale. Look at how cute! Look at how cute it looks. <laughs> um, Alright. Well, I'm going to go and no time lapse because that would be way too long. I don't know how long this is going to be, by the way. And yeah, if you guys were wondering, that island is completely straight. It's so straight. It's odd. I've never seen it like this, but it is straight. Um, And don't forget, this island right here where we started off building it 
this was made by me. I hand made that shape. So. Alright. We're gonna get to it. And I think I'm gonna start with the uh, island here. And it looks like there's a bat. Hold on. Do I have any blocks? You know what? I, I just noticed this right here. That <laughs> looks like a bat, kind of. Or a heart. <laughs> right there. Where my cursor is. It looks like a bat or a heart. I saw a bat at first. But... Alright. I'm, I'm just going to stop stalling. I'm going to get to it. I need a lot of prep. Oh, good. It's day. And this is the island I'm working with. Now, what I want to do is I want to make this area here. And I want to extend it out to there. I want to connect over there to over here. And that's really hard. But I'm going to do it now. First things first, I need to get rid of every single tree on the island. I will replant all of them afterwards, but I need to get rid of them for now because they're just in the way. I can't see the shape I'm working with with trees in the way, so I need to cut them all down. So, sorry for those Mr. Beast fans out there who donated for trees, but uh, I'm getting rid of all of them. The island is bare. I went ahead and said screw it, crafted up a flint and steel, and burned all of them off. But I will say though, there's this really oh, there's this really cool cave system that goes through, and I might actually keep it. Look at this; it just goes through. Of course, there's a skeleton in here, but it's really cool because it just loops around the whole like island and then ends up on this spot. I might actually keep this. Like, yeah, of course, it's going to be gigantic, it's going to be a big project, but that, that just adds something cool to it. I might make it look like someone was living there, or it was preserved, or something. I don't know. It's really cool looking, and I like it. But now, I'm starting to lay out the shape I want. I want both of these to connect. I might have them go out, or in, out, and then in again, like a bow, kind of, but I don't know. Alright, I'm going to get it done. Yee. So here's the shape I have for the island. I have it there, and then I'm fixing up this side. So this I'm going to leave alone, but I'm also going to bow it out here so it's not a drop. So let's see. I'll fly you around one more time, and then I'll keep going. There you go. Let's get up real quick. There you go. There's the shape. Uh, Alright. I'm not going to use dirt underneath the sand. Because that's a, dirt is actually a valuable resource in this build here. So, let's see. Right there. That's what I'm modifying right there. So, I wonder how big this is going to be on the map. Because it, it's a gigantic project. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. Redoing an entire island in Minecraft is a really big job. So... I gotta figure out what block I'm gonna use, because I don't want to use dirt. Alright, because of the nether project I've been doing, netherrack. I'm using netherrack, because I have way too much netherrack, and I hate that block. I hate it so much. It's disgusting, and it needs to die. Sleeping like this makes no sense, but, uh, sure is comfortable. <laughs> so, I just used three and a half stacks of netherrack, and it didn't even cover half of it. That's how big this project is. Three and a half stacks of netherrack did nothing to it. <laughs> I'm gonna need so many materials for this. So, that used a ridiculous amount of netherrack. I honestly, it felt like 30 minutes of placing, and that's only this section. This section's smaller, thank god. But, uh, there's so much, so much netherrack here. Now think of it. I now have to place this as sand or dirt. Which means I have even more than what I just used in netherrack. And that's a full, whoops, where is it? Ah, that's a full shulker boxes full of netherrack. That's a lot of resources just in that little area. I don't want to do this, man. Watch this. Ready? I can do this. Nope. Wait. Eh. Oh, I despawned. Dang it. Alright, so after um, an hour and a half, <laughs> we have this. And I like that. I like the shape. I still need to do... I Honestly, looking at the front, 
I still need to do something about this. Maybe smooth it out a little. And then maybe something around the back here. Because that's really flat and tall. And I don't like that. But as you can see. Went ahead and placed in all of it. And there's a lot of space to walk around here. I really don't know what I want to do about building walls up here. Maybe I want to bring them down. Or something. I don't know. But uh, that's what we have left. So. I need to sleep. <laughs> But I'm low on, I'm low on, I'm running low on rockets, so I might need to go back home. But, uh, yeah, so pretty much all of the foundation is down, pretty much. Now I just need the dirt part, which is laying down all of the uh, hills that lead up to it. I don't know what I'm going to put on this island. I just want to make it bigger, and that's exactly what I'm doing. So, alright, next part is right here. Alright, yet again, there you go. And I really like this. <laughs> you can see it's now smooth, and it looks way better. Not that little bit. That actually generated like that, and the cave is still there. But here you go. So I'll just give you guys, like, two seconds to look at that. I did all of this by hand. I'll give you a, from the behind. Wink, wink. So we've got here, from over here. And if we get on the island, I'll show you. Ooh, frame rate. I'll show you what it looks like. So, doing really good. And it looks nice. Ow. And I'm going to continue doing it because it's kind of fun. Although it's been three hours and I barely got any done. That rhymed. And I'm not ashamed to say that. <laughs> Alright, and here is the final product. Yes, I switched into spectator mode. I don't really care. So this is one side of the island done, and except for this little bit. This little bit I want to extend and round off, because it just doesn't look good. It's just too flat. So this is one side, this is the other. This side isn't done. I think you can tell which side was custom. <laughs> so I'm lagging a lot for some reason. And there you go. Alright, and that's what this episode's about. There's our new project. That project over there, the base project, is not done. I want to say that right now. There is no way this is getting done ever. This is a ongoing project. Why am I so laggy? Oh yeah, I got the map wall done. I, I'm pretty sure I said that already, but it looks awesome. And here's the island before, by the way. Right there, that's the island beforehand. So you can see even how much work we just got done just by doing that. And that's an insane amount of work to me honestly. Alright, well then, in that case, no, I'm not ending the video yet. We are gonna go get a map of that place, starting in here. Ta-da. Okay. Um, also, there's what I have. I have maps, yeah? I have a lot of maps. And we're gonna lock this one. Alrighty! Okay, we can't see it. What a waste of a map. Great. Good job, me. Good job, I forgot. I might need more than one map. Great. Alright, we're gonna lock this one anyways. There you go. So... I need another one. <laughs> and you know what? I might need four maps. Yeah, I'm gonna need four maps. Uh, maybe. I don't know. We're gonna find out, though. Do, 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 do. I need more rockets. Do, 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 do. Alright. Okay, where are we? Oh, we're good right here. How's that? There you go. Whoa! Okay. Wait. Is that, like, gravel or stone? Aha! Alright. That's annoying. Ah! I don't have any of that. We're just gonna have to do dirt. That's alright with me. Okay. Alrighty, we got it. And is it updated? Let's see. Yeah, yeah, it's gone. Alright. Why, why do I keep teleport, or, uh, teleporting?
Why do I keep using rockets when I can just teleport? I have waypoints for a reason. Um. Ow, that hurt. Alright. And we're gonna lock this map. There we go. Okay. So we have both maps. We're gonna put them over here for now. Look at the difference. <laughs> look at the giant. It's so big. I was about to say, look at the giant scale of it. Look at the progress. Look at how big that is now. Compared to that little bit there to boom. <laughs> boom to boom. That's insane. That is so big. I, I think you could fit. This might be a stretch. This is definitely a little stretch, but I think you could fit an ocean monument into that island. Like, if you cut it right there, it might be overhanging. Yeah, it's definitely overhanging there, but there it is there. It's bigger than an ocean monument. <laughs> that's insane. Okay. Well, that's the progress we have right there. Just done. Alright, I'm actually just gonna leave this here. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave out there, and then I'm gonna go get two more maps. We're just gonna leave it like that? No, I'm joking. I can't do that. No, no. I want this to just be of the monument itself. And that would obstruct from it. But that is absolutely insane. The scale that we just made. So. Alright. I am done. I cannot play any more Minecraft at all tonight. I am so tired. I am done. There's just no way I can fit in more Minecraft. Oh, I... You ever just get that feeling where you want to do something so bad? Wow. One sand. Nice. I used up all my sand. You ever just have that feeling where you want to do something so bad, so you do it, and then you're like halfway through, just, I don't want to do this anymore. That's That was me tonight. That was 100% me tonight. I uh, And it is currently 10.30 at night where I am right now. And, I mean, I was working on this for four hours now. You even fly out and it looks bigger. Because it is bigger. It's insane. All the other islands are dwarfed by this one. I don't even know what I want to put on this island. So, make it, make it, make it, make it, make it. Yeah. Alrighty. Well, I will see all you guys in the next one. I hope you enjoyed. I know it's a different style of video, but that doesn't really matter. That being said, love all of you, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.